Today is Tuesday, December 2nd, and it's time for your daily news from Garden City High School. I'm Griffin Brunson. And I'm Keith Carr. I'll be bringing you your, I'll be bringing you important news from the Garden City High School. <laughs> I'll be bringing you information from winter sports and activities. I'll be bringing you information from the counselor's office and career center. Your news starts right now. Our school news begins with winter sports and activities. The fifth annual brown and white wrestling duel will be held on today at 7 p.m. There will be a chili feed that will begin at 5.30 with a meet and greet afterwards. The duels will have 14 matches to de determine the varsity lineup. The Buffalo basketball teams will tip off their season this Thursday in the Hayes City Shootout. The action will continue through Saturday. This Friday, the Arts and Communications Academy will host their annual winter showcase at the event, there will be a fashion show, robotics demonstration, a modern show choir, and forensics performances. Additionally, there will be advertisers served by the culinary arts classes and art, and art show. The event will be held in the common area, lasts from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. The Garden City High School will present a Charlie Brown's Christmas on December 5th and 6th at 7.30 and December 7th at 2.30 p.m. in the Garden City High School Auditorium. Tickets will be $5 for adults and $3 for students. And that's all for your winter sports and activities. Let's take a look at weather with BBS TV's meteorologist, Madison Farr. Hi, I'm Madison Farr, and I'll be bringing you all your Buffalo weather today. Let's take a look at the radar. Right now, as you can see on the radar, we have some storms going on in the Appalachian Mountains over here and also down in Southern California. Let's take a look at the highs. In Denver, it's 57. In Dallas, 48. St. Louis, 42 and Kansas City 42. Now let's take a look at the forecast. Today is sunny with a high near 48. Tonight, partly cloudy with a low around 23. Wednesday, mostly sunny with a high near 41. Now back to Keith Carr with information from the counselor's office and career center right after this. Thanks, Madison. The counseling office news begins with ACT test day information. ACT registration packets are available in the Career Center, the career counselor's office, or you may register on www.actstudent.org. Deadlines are rapidly approaching, so register quickly. From the GCHS Career Center, if you're a college-bound junior, remember that the College Board recommends students to take ACT during the second semester of their junior year. For more information on ACT tests, stop by the Career Center and check out the ACT website. Joustons will be at GCHS during lunch on Thursday, December 4th to try to finish up the senior orders. Recently, GCHS was visited by a DEA agent to discuss career opportunities for students. From, for more on here's BBS TV's Alexandria Turukul. Wednesday, November 19th, Drug Enforcement Administration's Mike Tabor and Kansas Bureau of Investigations, John Natchman, has spoken to a few students at Garden City High School about their division. Right Junior Stacy Ortiz gives us a look at what she had learned from the speakers. Um, I think uh, I learned a lot about all the information. I got a good insight of what opportunities they have um, in different careers fitting it. Junior Norma Morales tells us what's nice to hear from others. I thought that, you know, I really learned a lot about, you know, the field about like forensics and um, law. And I 
it was nice to hear about things that, you know, we wouldn't necessarily hear about in our other day, everyday classes. Whether the job is in action or in office, John Nachman and Mike Tabor gave students a great opportunity to learn more about the health and investigation field, this including wages, the many careers their field gives, and the outcome of working as one of them. I'm Alexandria Terrical, BBS TV. Thanks, Alex. That's all the news from the Counseling Office and Career Center. Now back, to, back with more Buffalo news with Griffin right after this. Thank you for joining us today on Buffalo News as we have given you a look at the important news from Garden City High School. For the award-winning staff and crew of Buffalo News, I'm Keith Carr. And I'm Griffin Brunson. Have a great day. Yay!